Alan Pease is an Australian author and motivational speaker. Also known as Mr. Body Language, he is the number one expert on nonverbal communication and establishing relationships. He started out as a musician, then became a successful life insurance salesman and later developed a career as a speaker and trainer in sales techniques and in body language. Now he is traveling the world to deliver keynote addresses, appears regularly in media worldwide and advises everyone from business executives and prime ministers to TV presenters, royalty and rock stars. He has written 18 bestsellers including 10 number ones and have sold over 27 million copies. Their monthly relationship column alone had over 21 million readers. Alan, real pleasure to be here with you. Terrific, pleasure is mine. Super. Well, there's two things. First, body language we know accounts for 60 to 80 percent of all the impact that's taking place between two people. What you say, the words, things you can write down accounts for 7 to 10 percent. So what you say doesn't matter that much. In reality, the way you look, appear and behave, which shows your emotions and what you're feeling is the most important thing. And business today is not about business first. It's about people. If people buy you, they feel comfortable with you, they like you, they feel like you're not intimidating, that they feel like you probably respect them, that you even like them. If people buy you, there's a good chance they'll buy what goes with you. If you're in any, anything that doesn't make you feel that way, the first thing we suggest to people is you've got to quit. Yeah. Now, it doesn't mean you go and quit tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, it means you've got to decide that somewhere in the near future, you have got to get out of that because yeah. two reasons. One is you're not doing yourself a favour. You're dragging yourself along and wasting your life. Yeah. And secondly, whoever you're work working for, you're not giving them the best possible thing that they can get. Yeah. You know, the bosses need good performance for you and they're not getting that either. Yeah. So you've got to decide that somewhere in the near future to get out of what it is you're going to do. Now, it may not be tomorrow, but it might be in six months or in a year or two years or maybe somewhere in the future. What it is you want to be, become or have. And that's, this is the secret, is to decide clearly. Don't think about how. This is the thing. Do not think about it. People think about, well, how would I become a millionaire? How would I build my own business? And they can't think of it, so they don't do anything. Yeah. They go back to their job, yeah. and they spend their life in a job being unhappy because we know that 80% of people are unhappy in their job. Mm -hmm. And so decide what it is you want, but don't think about how you're going to get it. And this is so important. Yeah. The minute you think about how, you can't think about how, so therefore you lose faith and momentum in the idea of it. And to be a successful person as an entrepreneur or in business is thinking about what you do want as opposed to what you don't want. Yeah. And it's a real, real pleasure. Thank that's you a seven much. out of ten. I like yeah, that. That's a seven out of ten. We can keep going. <laughs> we can keep going. <laughs> and see where we end up. Real pleasure, sir. Pleasure, Thank you. Rick.